Small businesses are the backbone of America. Many struggled through the pandemic. I visited a hidden gem that survived the lockdowns and is set to celebrate 50 years of business. It's bittersweet though, after an immense loss. People just love being here. We all love being here. The Bookies is nothing extravagant from the outside. It sits in a little shopping center off Colorado Boulevard in Denver. But inside, a family adventure. Should we head up to the counter and pick up your book you pre-ordered? And for the staff, it's made up of mainly retirees, many of them former teachers. We don't make a lot of money. <laughs> Probably goes without saying. We all yeah. work part time. Do you have this one? So many stories fill the shelves here, but there is one that tops them all. She's here every day <laughs> at some level. 50 years ago, Sue Lubeck decided the children of Denver needed a magical bookstore. She filled her basement with children's books and opened her doors. The bookies expanded, of course, into what it is today. <laughs> Okay. It's the most loving, supportive community. This week, the bookies will celebrate 50 years of business without the one who started it all. We were devastated. They, there's no other word for it. Sue passed away in July, but not before leaving a lasting impact on the customers she loved so much. We should all be so lucky to leave such a legacy. A place where kids learn to love books, even in the toughest of times. How many books did you read? Well, last time we counted it was 247, but by now it's probably 300. Just during quarantine? Yes. Wow. <laughs> the Bookies is up for sale now, with the hope whoever buys it will keep it the way it is. I just think it's so important that we keep businesses like this alive. That way, Sue's story will continue to resonate in the very place she created. Sue told me that she used to say to her kids when they'd leave for something, make me proud. I thought, I'm going to make Sue proud, so I hope I do. Well, you certainly made her proud. And if you want to help celebrate the bookie's 50 year anniversary and help remember Sue, head over to the store this Saturday from 10 to 5. The store is just east of Colorado Boulevard off Mississippi.